Uh, I had a company. I did myself a lot of sport. So physiotherapist is my education. And I got injured and I decided to become a physiotherapist. We were manufacturing things like this machine. The big motivation to bring me to a coal plant was the locomat. I did not even have the thought that I might end up myself in, in this type of machine. Sometimes we are not so aware about how much it means to be capable of walking. It's emotional, it's really hard for the patient. You couldn't do your, your toilet things. They have the feeling that they lost all their freedom. You couldn't eat even by yourself. They really go through a lot. And when you see what they are capable of... You see a new situation, you adapt to it. There's a lot of potential in the body and in the brain. Compared to how I was in that emergency room, that's a huge difference. Today I don't even feel handicapped. When you're a baby, you learn how to walk and then you just walk. You never think how complex it is, right? You need a lot of strength. You really need different systems of your body to be working continuously and to be synchronized. And it's so impressive to see a machine helping you to move again. I realize it's a complicated machine when I look at it, but when you're in it, you really don't feel you are in a complex machine, right? We want the patient to participate, to try to be active, to think about the movement. The locomotive can really contribute to the intensity. I try to follow the movement of the locomotive with my own muscles. We can really activate the patient to walk with the locomotive. But you also need a repetition. You need to make a lot of steps to regain the neural pathways. In normal physiotherapy, you cannot have so many movements done as you have it here. You can train for 20, 30 or even 40 minutes on the locomotive without having to take a break. It's very important that the therapist is also motivating the patient, engaging the patient. Then there are features that allow us to challenge the patient. There are several games. I have tested them all. The patient directly understands if he's performing well or not. I can control the direction with the remaining force that I have in my legs. He activates even more and he's getting even a better results. I always want to break my own record. So it's this cycle of motivation and participation that will allow us to have better outcomes. We are launching the new sensation package. We have auditory cueing, we have the music. Some people, they really like music, so they are really triggered by the audio feedback, where the patient really can have the rhythm. Elvis moves in the most funny way. <laughs> For every patient, there is some kind of feedback that will help them. I'm 63 years old, I still react on these games. <laughs> it's a powerful tool on your toolbox. And what makes the success of the therapy? It's the way you use your tools and the way you adapt to the needs of your patient. The food is different each time I come here. Every angle of the locomat you can adjust. I'm really happy that the engineer did all the algorithms. It's really very easy. Actually, with a simple click on the software, you can adjust the locomat. Being a physiotherapist is also a hard physical job, so technology came to help us. On a normal session I make about one kilometer of walking, way beyond something a physiotherapist would do in a session. The locomat can really provide the intensity of the training and also the repetition of the movement. So the machine is doing this hard job and allows the therapist to do a quality work, to focus on other important aspects. After the locomotor training, I really feel better. Blood circulation, the digestive functions, they all improve. The legs get much more flexible. The spasms are, have been reduced remarkably. There are many researchers that locomotor therapy will improve independent walking for the patient. On an emotional level, I really feel like walking normally and they enjoy that feeling so much because they, they didn't do it for so long. And if you are handicapped, you realize that this is the most important thing in life, how you feel about things.